Good morning, everybody. I am coming up into our back pasture to try to get um, Buck and Ken to come down in the barn. They've had a few days off and they've up, been up in the big pasture. Uh, I just wanted to give you a quick update as to what I'm doing with Buck since he's had this thyroid problem. I've got some minerals, so I wanted to show you that and uh, show you how I feed it and we'll see how that works. So now I have to go find these horses. Um, when my horses are close to home in the in the short pasture, I can usually just whistle to them. They come right in the barn. But when they get their freedom for a couple of days out in the big field, it's not always that simple. Um, so I have a four wheeler, and I don't necessarily, don't really chase them with the four wheeler. But I usually go up around them with a the four wheeler and holler at them. They usually head to the barn. They don't mind going to the barn. But um, when they have their freedom and green grass in the pasture, they kind of enjoy that too. So, um, but hopefully they won't cause me troubles and they'll go right down to the barn. We'll see how it goes. Get to the barn. Get. Get to the barn. Come on, guys. Get to the barn. Come on. Get, get, get. Come on. Get, get, get. Come on. Get, 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 get. Get, Ken. Come on. Come on. Come on. Get out of here. Come on. Get. Get out there. Get out of the woods. Head for the barn. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. All right, Ken. Come on. Get. 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 Come on, get to the barn. Come on. Come on. Get. 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 His last owner's car, I guess. We've got it parked it up here, probably. Come on, guys. Get. Get the barn. Get, get, come on, come on, get, come on, get in there, come on. Now we'll get the four wheeler. Hopefully they'll run right down the barn. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. Hope they don't go back up into the woods. I guess I, I guess I'm kind of doing it the lazy way. I brought halter up. I could leave him down, but that'd be a more sure thing. This is a simpler thing, and it usually works. I hope people don't think I'm mean, as if I'm chasing these horses with the four-wheeler. These horses are no more scared of this four-wheeler than they are scared of me. They just have a habit, and when I come up to get them, whether I was on foot or on the four-wheeler, I almost always holler at them like this, and they just run right back down the barn. They know where they're going. They're not a, afraid in any way. They're perfectly happy headed back to, to the barn. I sure do love to watch my horses kick up their heels and run like that. You know, they're feeling pretty good when they're running like that. It's not a run from being scared, it's just a run from feeling good.
we really get some rain. Barnyard's a muddy mess. Hey guys, ready to come in? Bunch of salt, huh? Couple days without salt. Well, you could have come down for some. Look at the flies on you. Come here, guys. That door there, Ken's half scared of that door. It wasn't too bad right there now, but sometimes he hates going through there. All right. How we doing, huh? While we're right here, you see buck good, that's the thyroid problem. It's not even visible hardly at all. Well, there it is, there it is. So hopefully those minerals will take care of that problem. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Big hurry. Let's give a little taste of grain. I'm kind of excited. I'm finally getting in my head how I want to redo my horse barn. I've got ideas for how to do the stalls themselves, and I've also got them, some lumber drawing that I'm going to put through my planer and probably tongue and groove it to put on the ceiling. So many of these jobs are so difficult to do with everything else I have going on with the farm and logging and sawmill. It makes it very difficult to get everything done I want to do, but we just plug away at it. I think that's the way it is with a lot of people. We don't always have the money or the time to do what would be to do what we'd really like to do. We just do the best we can. Okay, here's the minerals that uh, I, I had, uh, my bet was got for me that. She said it'll probably work good. Um, it's a, a lighter flex um, mineral. Um, I'm not getting paid to pr promote this at all, and I don't know anything about it. I'm just going to try it. And uh, But maybe down the road we can tell you how well it's done because I hope to in a couple months get uh, Buck um, tested again, get, have blood samples, and and see where his selenium level is and so we'll know how well this particular brand has done for us. So all it is is a pellet and uh, it's uh, supposed to be one scoop per horse per day so um, I actually this is <laughs> mid-morning so the other two have already had their grain I don't know, I'm assuming you put it with the grain. I'm curious to see if we'll even eat it. Um, just straight up like this. Uh, I'm going to try it with the other two, but with the blacks, they still have some grain, so I'm going to give them their, their scoop right in the grain. i have to figure out a better way to do this than this big bucket. Get it up, get it up. Probably I'll get a small container to walk through and scoop a scoop out of each time that I do this. I'm curious, I, like I said, I put palladium bills right into the empty bucket and so I'll come out at the time to see if they've cleaned it up. So, anyways, that's what we're trying. This is what it is and I hopefully will give you an update in a month or so or a couple months or down the road to see how we like it. Okay, that's it. Thanks. Have a good day.